Hello people, it's Gonict and welcome back to a brand new Crossfire West video. So, uh, if you'll be able to notice, I'm in channel 7 right now. And uh, this can only mean one thing. That's right, it's time for another crate opening. Uh, I've been doing uh, quite a few of those actually, recently. But, uh, you know... I enjoy them, you enjoy them, so why stop, you know, when we get the opportunity to do one, uh, we won't skip on it. Um, so yeah, here is, uh, this is uh, what I've been able to uh, gather uh, this month for this uh, monthly event crate opening. Uh, only one little difference is that we're gonna be excluding these three purple green crates. Uh, since they are actually for next month, they are for, from uh, July's uh, weekend event. Uh, but for some reason, uh, today it's like June 30th, and for some reason they counted it as, uh, you know, a weekend for July. I don't know why they did that, but yeah, I can't do anything about it. And the crate is pretty bad too, so they will pretty much be used as decoy crates for me if anything else uh, but uh, I, yeah I think this month we have quite a few good crates uh, this one is very weird the golden balloon crate but uh, yeah we'll see what we can do uh, before we start what I usually do is I come here and select the crate tycoon achievement uh, so uh, yeah I should probably do that and uh, yeah we're at channel 7 we have Fever 3, we are ready to start opening crates. Uh, let's start with this one lonely golden balloon crate. Let's see what this is all about. I oh, just got a few GP and a, a coupon. Alright, well, you know, <laughs> that was very weird, but okay, I'll take it. Um, now also I've, I've counted uh, the crates, they are like 156, if I'm not mistaken, so a nice 150 uh, crate opening for this month as well, so we are expecting a permanent. Uh, so uh, let's uh, go, I see a lot of, uh, wait, on, on, only these two, yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, let's go for the Spring Fair crate as our pretty much first crate, because that one uh, golden balloon crate doesn't really count. So yeah, let's see what we can do. Let's see if Lady Luck is going to smile for us today. Uh, yeah, also I know they added this, I, I was actually talking about this in a previous video, they actually added this, um, you know, this function where you can uh, uh, spin multiple crates at once. I'm gonna be using that, but for a later video, uh, possibly for, uh, you know, GP crates, uh, because they are quite a bit of hassle to uh, open. Uh, but for the moment, you know, we are uh, following our traditions and opening them nice and slowly. I should probably save five of these, because I see that they have the shock absorber and I would really like to use the um, yeah, the lucky gauge on that although, this golden June crate, I think I won something from this I think it was the uh, chain, the cuck chainsaw do I also have a Cheetah ultimate gold? no, that's in my other account uh, but uh, yeah, anyway um, these blue aura crates and these water water crates are not so, you know, yeah. I mean, the skins are pretty good, but, you know, pretty basic anyway. So, uh, yeah, let's get on with these. And uh, first lucky gauge of the day coming in for the spring green crate. I would like to win a spring themed weapon, but here I won two shovels which will mean two coupons for me and two EXP clan bags that's not too bad although channel 7 once again you are disappointing me I don't know what to say I mean I can't remember what what was the last time I won in channel 7 man 
Channel 7 needs to uh, pick up its game again, you know? If it is to win my trust again. Although I instinctively start from channel 7 because I like to think that 7 is my lucky number. Now, I don't really believe like in lucky numbers and stuff, but there is a pretty funny slash sad story of how that came to be. I'm not gonna say... Oh my god! Alright, oh, as I say that, I win the M41S Water! Yeah! I think this is like a semi-transparent skin of some sort. It's kind of see-through. So it would be pretty cool. I'm already thinking uh, of myself making a full gameplay video with these weapons. So, okay. I'm gonna take it. So channel 5, kudos to you. Thank you. You actually made me win. Alright, so first win of the day already in the bag. And uh, I also think that we're gonna be hitting 150 coupons, so we're also going to be getting a weapon from the coupon shop. So, at least we are walking away with two new weapons today, so that's a very good uh, situation to be in, if you ask me. But let's continue here, and uh, let's see what else we can do. Okay, uh, four more crates to go for the water crate, I, I, if I recall correctly it only has two permanents, one of them was the M4A1 and there is also an AWM or something, I don't remember exactly but okay, I mean I had purchased these from the EP shop because they put out an event where you could uh, buy some, uh, oh! Wow, isn't that amazing? <laughs> exactly 150 coupons. I was like, yeah, you know, I should check because uh, I might have reached them, but uh, yeah, here you go. So let's check actually. Scarlight Black. Do I have the Scarlight Black? Uh, Scarlight. Scarlet Silver. So I don't have it. I remember I got the Deagle Tiger last time. Did I also get the Kukri? Uh, Kukri Tiger, Kukri Tiger... I don't see it. So maybe I need to buy that. Because I was thinking about getting the XM8 Germany. Uh, because I have gotten both snipers. I got the Dragoon of Tiger 9 and the SL8. Which was one of the first three weapons in Crossfire Europe, if you remember. So. I have everything from here, these two, uh, these three, I got them all as well, and I got the Deagle Tiger, so which one do I buy? Uh, Kukri Tiger, Scarlight Black or XM8 Germany? I think I'm gonna go for the Kukri, because uh, yeah, I have quite a few XM8s, I have a few Kukris, and a few, Sc I mean, I have variants from, from everything of these. But I guess the cookery matches with the beagle as well, so here you go. Let me make sure I don't have it, because for some reason, I don't know why, but just for some reason I remember myself buying it. Now, am I tripping over here? Possibly, possibly. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm tripping, so let's buy this, come on. I'm not crazy. Alright, there we go. I bought it. And here it is, yeah, now I have it. Perfect. Alright, so let's change the channel as well and let's move on to the uh, blue aura crate. There we go, next one. The next of the big guns. Every crate that I have more than 20, I consider it to be a big gun. So let's go for the spring greens again. And will we get a double? Yes! Double shock absorber, exactly what I wanted. Perfect. Let's continue with the blue aura crate. Alright, so... Try different percentances as well, gotta remind myself of that, because I instinctively spin at 50%. Because I have so many memories with the old uh, crate system. 
with the wheel and everything, I would mostly spin at 50%, because most people claim to win weapons there. But, uh, yeah, I know it doesn't matter, it's just a psychological thing, you know. Whenever you spin a crate, it just... It's just an RNG of three items. I don't think the percentage that you spin at plays any role in this. Otherwise, you know, people would figure out where you can win each weapon and everybody would win. And that obviously doesn't happen, so... Yeah. Okay. Five to go for the Blue Aura 1 crate. That sounds like a good skin, though. I wonder how they look like. I mean, I know I bought them from the EP shop. Good job, me. And I don't even remember how they look. I mean, I'm sure it's like a combination of dark blue and bright blue. More like uh, dark blue and turquoise, even. By the way, how, how do you spell turquoise? Because I'm pretty sure I'm saying it wrong. Anyway, so that was the uh, Blue Aura 1 crate. Let's go to channel 3, and let's go for the Blue Aura 2 crate. So same uh, family of weapons, different skin, uh, different, I mean, different uh, types of weapons. Um, okay, Lucky Gage, Spring Greens, here it goes. Oh, no, no double shock absorber this time, but we'll have two more opportunities. So let's not give up just yet. And we got a double coupon again. Nice, another coupon in the form of a rose grenade. One coupon. I'm thinking about doing a like super massive. I mean, someone someone mentioned it in my comments. Someone asked me to do a 1,000 GP crate opening at once. Uh, with this new system, that's definitely possible, and I'm gonna do that at some point. I mean, right now I have like 10 more GP crate openings to release that I haven't uh, released yet. I have uploaded them, but they are still, you know, unlisted. Uh, so I have to uh, slowly release those, and then I'll be able to do more. And uh, yeah, I'll, I'll do this uh, when, I, when I get the opportunity. So, for the moment, let's focus on the Blue Aura 2 crate. We have 5 to go. So far, nothing really surprising. Smoke Helm, 3 days. Yep, it's the one we are stacking currently. So, uh, very happy about that as well. Another coupon in the form of a Rose Grenade. Came pretty close there. One to go. That's a no, but that's a double coupon. Okay, channel one. All the even number. Uh, uh, I mean, all the odd numbers. Okay, so fantastic creatures. What is this all about? Like, doesn't even give a hint about what this could be. But I guess we won't be finding out unless we get extraordinary lucky so spring greens attempt number three i think with a lucky gauge two times ten thousand the two coupons yep not bad at all let's continue with these fantastic crate uh, creatures <laughs> fantastic creatures more like fantastic crates but if i don't see what's in them i can't judge you know i can't tell if it's fantastic crate or not so for Fantastic Creatures 1, we won't be finding out. Let's see if that will change once we start opening for Fantastic Creatures 2. Let's see here. Uh, very close. Come on. Oop. That was pretty bad. Ah, oh, come on. Don't do this. When it misses by one... It's always so intimidating. All right. Um, yeah, no win, unsurprisingly. Let's move on back to channel 7. For some reason, I have a little bit more faith now than before. Let's go for the spirit crate. I'm leaving the best for last, if you have noticed already. 
and by the best for last I mean of course the tagged crate. Maybe I should start using my lucky gauge on this one from now on, huh. Alright, well, I don't think I have enough crates to uh, open them all with uh, lucky gauge, but we have seen time and time and again that lucky gauge is not necessary to win a weapon. I'd say it's a little bit harder to win with a lucky gauge. I mean, it's a hot take, but take it with a pinch of salt. Alright, two more for the spirit crate. Smoke helm, nice. A coupon, okay. Alright. Uh, uh, we said we're not touching these. There's one left here. I'm gonna save it. Let's go for these five turtle shell crates. Interesting skins, but weapons are pretty basic. Alright, last lucky gates to go for... Hopefully another double shock absorber. Let's go. Ah, uh, no, we didn't. But we got two coupons, so that's okay. That's okay, that's not the worst. Alright, so... Turtle shell. Oh, it has a shock absorber as well. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'm not saving these. I need to start spinning uh, the tagged ones with the lucky gauge on. Yeah, we wouldn't get any more shock absorber anyway. So, uh, yeah, channel 7, I'm sorry, my dude. It's not your day today, or I don't know what, what to say. Okay, so Golden June crate. I, I just hope I don't win something that I already have again. Because that would be a pretty bad thing to deal with. I really don't like looking at the duplicates inside my storage. But let's see. There's still hope. I mean, we are opening 150 crates, so 1.5 permanence we are expecting that falls dead center between 1 and 2 so that means if we get lucky we get 2 if we're not so lucky we only get 1 let's see which of the 2 will prevail alright quite a few coupons actually we're getting a lot of coupons today wow see another double coupon I'm actually surprised okay so that lucky gauge is filling up, 10,000 GP, nice, and uh, we're gonna go for some nice tagged crate, hopefully we'll get the Colt out of it, because I really like it, it's very useful, it will be very useful for ranked, since that version of Colt is one of the few pistols that can, you know, go head to head with a VIP cop, for example. Alright, uh, lucky gauge and tag 2 crate. Show me what you've got. Nothing, just garbage. That was a garbage opening. Wow. Alright, well, if that's how you want to play, we'll play. That's another triple 1000 uh, GP. I guess the, the effects of the unlucky gauge don't go away until a few crates later. L yeah, look at that. Third time this has happened. Come on. This was better. Uh, somewhat better. Come on, man. Pop that golden c capsule. Whatever that is, crate capsule, I don't know. Still baffles me to this day how they call it crates, but they're clearly capsules. <laughs> Alright, 20 to go. Uh, so I'm gonna change channels. I'm gonna go to channel. Which one haven't I been to? Let's go to channel 2. Two for two permanents, come on, let's go. Gimme, gimme, gimme. 
something, something, something that I, already, that I don't already have, please. Yeah, I have to specify that so that, uh, you know, I can say that I said it just in case we have an accident of that kind. Come on, man. Come on. Shouldn't be too hard. Alright, lucky gates time. Oh boy. I think this is our last lucky gates, by the way. Yep. Garbage. Why am I even surprised by this? Yeah, this was our last lucky gates of the day. Oh well. So much for the lucky gauge. Let's do the rest. Let's see if we can uh, scalvet something right at the end. Even though it's. It looks like it will be unlikely. Don't really see it happening, but let's see, it's not over just yet. We have a few crates more to go, because we also have the tagged crates, remember? So, Golden June, final attempt. Nope, nothing. So, the tagged two crate, five crates left, this is our only chance, let's go. Nothing out of the ordinary, so let's go for a 75er, approximately. I didn't give anything special. 50%, dead center. And the last one... Nope. Alright. Well, one permanent and one weapon from the coupon shop. And we actually, by the looks of it, will have quite a few more coupons. There you go, 40 from these. Another 21 from these, and another 5, so we're at 117, we're getting close again. So, with all of you, you know the drill, you go straight to my inventory, because you'll be made very good use of. Okay, so let's inspect our uh, only winning from a capsule, from a crate, was the M41S. Water, a very interesting one, albeit I, I have to say it like it looks like very interesting. I, uh, I can't wait to try it in game. Actually, I don't think I've seen anyone use this before, and for a good reason, I think. But uh, yeah, you know. And we also got, don't forget, the Kukri Tiger from the uh, coupon shop. So two new weapons added to my collection. I'm also gonna be finishing the mercenary pass soon, so we'll have one more. Uh, but uh, yeah, for today that was it. Let me just make a quick relog over here because I wanna sort my stuff out. Because you know, every time you win a name tag, it automatically switches to that, and that annoys the heck out of me. So I have to manually come back and reselect everything that I had. Uh, let's check for how many days we have the shock absorber. I think I, I had it for like 50 days or, uh, before. So now it's 52 days. Wait, that's that, that can't be possible. We want it like four times. Huh, okay. So I guess my initial value was wrong. Alright, well. Green muzzle flame, of course, because we are on team green. And we also have 108 free crate tickets. That gives me clearance for two openings in the future. 198 days on my smoke helm. These 55 days unfortunately go to waste, but there's not much we can do about it. My uh, tactical suit YB character. <coughs> I've had him since uh, 2016 back from Crossfire Europe. Oh, now that I've talked about toe tags, because that's where I want that from, 
we are very close to a toe tag opening of some sorts. Uh, when I complete this month's mercenary pass, I'll actually have 110 toe tags and I'll do a video of me opening them in a zombie mode game. Now, I, I haven't thought of the map. If you guys have an idea, let me know what map should I uh, open them at. But yeah, that would be another pretty interesting uh, uh, thing to be on the lookout for. So, uh, that's it for today. Uh, thank you guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, I'll be back with uh, gameplays and everything uh, sooner than usual, uh, but up until that point, you know the drill, smash that like button, uh, click the subscribe button, and uh, if you want to help me in a more active way, there is a donation link, not mandatory of course, but you know, it just helps cover my basic expenses and help my family because you know how rough times are and uh, yeah i don't think i should talk anymore about that so love you all see you next time